Is OG versus Mineski? Let's go ahead and get into it. Whoa, OG, Mineski, get ready for Dota. That's pretty high. In. <laughs> will, right. we, will we see about it? Oh my yeah, god, that's that, that that we're all talking about, the new hero. Everybody's going crazy. Yeah. What's the deal, Fog? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It just it was like out of nowhere. I'm just like walking by like the, the universe playing that it. Recently was playing the, it. with the ultimate where you can actually pop it when you're stunned. When you're stunned. Yeah. Of all the people during Frankfurt, I was kinda, you know, Ooh. bumping elbows with uh, Bruno a bit and he said, I think Abaddon's gonna be a big deal. He said Agnum's Abaddon's gonna be a big deal. But that's can, a, can you ever reach that point? It's hard to farm. It's really hard to farm. That's when, that's when you pick an alchemist. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> hey! Yeah, you said. Yep, you said the Night Stalker. And there's a Queen of Pain still in the pool, too. Queen of Pain still in the pool. A Tusk, tusk still as in well. Pool. And J.O. will, in fact, be drafting for Mineski. Yeah. Oh, Dazzle. <laughs> We're going for Huskar, what do you think about it? Oh, actually, yeah, that's... But Huskar is terrible, okay, I guess. It's terrible versus Doom, but they have Dazzle. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna really stop them. Oh, gee, we'll, probably, we'll probably pick up Tusk here, right? Mm. They get Tusk and Doom. Yep. What do you think, with those opening picks? That sounds pretty good to me. <laughs> <laughs> yep. you, you know what we always say? Oh, wow, I'm dying. You know what we always yeah. say? Tuscar is a Dota 2 hero. Yep. Where we see some snowball saves. Yep. He's fun. Fun to watch. Good hero. Really good hero. Yep. Yep. Flies are dying. It's something they always like to put a lot of priority into, though. You know, I was talking to him yesterday, and he told me, I actually didn't realize when I get so many decay stacks, I actually get bigger on my dying. Like, actually bigger? Yeah, like, big scale? Yeah, yeah really? scale. It's <laughs> fun. Here you can see, J.O., don't look at me. Don't look there at it me. is. A scar ban. No surprise. Yeah, obviously. I mean, you're going against Mineski. They and first face out of Dazzle. You have to remove the Tusk, right? Like, if you give away Tusk and Undying on the same team, the early game is so strong. Yeah. Doom, Tusk, Undying. That's some scary shit. Yeah, it is. Real spooky. PL ban. Oh, I like the monkey ban. Why? Why banning on the PL? It's still one of the heroes out there as well. It's one of the heroes that they like to run a lot too. Yeah. Mm. That's right, Big Daddy does like to play yeah, a lot. Yeah, plays it a bunch. Is he done with Big Daddy? Should I not be calling him that anymore? I think he's moved back. I think, I'm gonna ask him that. I think he's moved on. His he's team moved. calls him Big Daddy. I heard Fly say it to him yesterday, so... It's just a term of endearment what for now. Got? What do we got? Hmm. Do you, are we gonna see any AA? We thought AA was gonna be picked actually a lot earlier in this. It depends so this on what team they are playing. Cause like some teams, they were like, I remember when T Bone was playing on Cloud Nine, they were first pick. Yeah, first pick the hero. Yep. I mean, we already see three heroes with a lot of HP regen. Yeah. So there's still Queen of Pain in the pool. Bane they is also still out there. Are these teams with a lot of Bane? Oh, gee, my. There's still Tusk. Tusk, Quap, Tusk, Quap. The two tier one here. They would have been all the cheese hero, I feel. Like, Quap. Oh, yeah, there's the Quap Ben. What other cheese heroes are there left? That's still Meepo, though. I don't know. <laughs> they were talking about that. Like, so far, their two heroes are really terrible. Like, Nice Talker and Dazzle are not really good versus Meepo. Nope. They usually run, what, the Night Stalker as a support, or is it an yeah, offlane? support. Okay. Mostly support, but sometimes they do run him offlane. Okay. But I'm not sure if they're running the same type of strategy, yeah, because J.O. is drafting, up. so I'm not, I'm not too sure about that. It looks pretty similar. Yeah, Last year so also ignored completely up to this point. No team putting a line to that hole. Oh, uh, it would fit Mineski's lineup really Yeah, oh yeah. Now that the Gyrocopter's been Dark picked Stalker, up. Gyro. Very, very good. Here we can see the... Orangutan gangsters prepping up in the room then. <laughs> crit very focused. Carnage, please. Carnage, sorry. Carnage. Are uh, we gonna use focused. that name? No, he's using crit. Dude. Dude? He has crit. He's using crit. <laughs> yeah, but he's Carnage now. That's what he says. Carnage is back. Well, you see a gyrocopter, a dazzle, and night stalker here. What about crit zero? Wyvern or tusk, right? Wyvern or tusk, yeah. Don't forget the, the mighty Jikiro. Nah. Oh, he hasn't played it. He hasn't, he hasn't played, played it at all. Lately. He hasn't played it so like for such a long time that I. It hasn't been that long. It's been like a month, maybe. Yeah. I feel yeah, like it's forever it's, though. It's, though. It's yeah. so In Dota, it is forever. <laughs> yeah, there's Wyvern. Why is everyone like getting all the heroes that they want to get? <laughs> Really though? I don't know. I mean, if they got those heroes that are banned, I, I, you could say the same thing. Yeah. 
There's just a lot of heroes. OG draft coming out already. <laughs> <laughs> so we are. Powerhouse. We are thinking about like Doxia. Um, what else like would fit? Doxia's banned. I think I may be blind, but I oh, can yeah. see that. Dude, Mr. you hear the guy who mentioned Doxia? You were Doxia. Yeah. I know. I'm trying to pawn that off. <laughs> <laughs> well played. Well played. I mean, they're still Slada. Like sometimes they run startup. Slada also banned. banned. Oh jeez. Right. So oh, <laughs> <laughs> My glasses are not working. Help. Uh, well, I should be using this screen. This screen is better. Yeah, yeah that's why I, mean, I don't know why we're doing that. We're all looking up there. I'm not, dude. I'm, I'm squatting. I'm looking right in. So I'm Vanessa blind as hell. Is got... hmm. There goes my screen now. Yep, help. Get on. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is AA too crazy here? You got a Wyvern, Undying, and Doom. Oh, okay, I nice. guess not. They're going to go with the man who so loves Lords, It isn't. So it's a nice stalker off lane. Yeah, nice stalker off lane. Mitch, nice stalker. Is that the right pick over something like the AA, where you have Wyvern heal, Undying heal, and Scorched Earth Razor? Mm, it's really priority, so I feel like Lich is a support that wins you the lane. I would consider him like Bane, but I would prefer Bane over Lich. Like, the only situation where Lich would be better than Bane is if you want to run off lane support to win the lane. Like Lich and Night Stalker, that's what they are aiming to do. But it's really strange that they're not up against, uh, at that point, they're not up against a lot of physical damage. So the Lich is really peculiar for me. Reserved. You better make that early laning phase count then. They don't even know what yeah. kind of safe laders they're like going to be really going against here. Razor. OG doesn't pick Razor too often, do they? Sometimes. Mm, sometimes. 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 Versus Gyro. Yeah, it's Gyro. mostly versus Gyro. You, you sap his damage and yep. you just try to nullify his damage. He's really good versus fight. Night Stalker. Yeah, well. he is. Yes. Oh, I like that shot. Everyone man. is like target spells, you know? Like yeah. target spell sucks versus Razor. I think versus the Night Stalker, generally the playstyle though is just group up a lot and they have a really, yep. really strong really four man yep. group. Matt Carrier, a lot of heal, which surprisingly Mineski has not really countered. I don't think they have enough damage to get through all that heal. We're talking yeah. about like Scorched Earth, Soul Rip, plus Cold Embrace, and then probably a mech. Ice I mean, Blast would have been good, actually. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, okay. what we're talking about. I, was like, I mean, hello? hello. 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 <laughs> and now the option is not really open to them at all. And they don't have enough damage because the heavy AOE mids are I think if out. they don't win their lanes, they're going to be in so much trouble. Yeah, for sure. Mm-hmm. OG can just group up and it's going to be really hard for them to fight. They need a... Uh, Do you like Invoker so that you can delay the push? Burn their mana? Mm. Delay for what though? <laughs> Gyro to be Gyro to get owned Gyro. by Razor later with a BKB? <laughs> but what else can you do, dude? I think you can another carry go all in on the lanes. Cause that's how many yeah, wins get a games. Viper here, so you didn't sure. Oh, TA. a TA. Dire side TA. A TA is like bad, but it's like 1v1 against Razor. A TA loses. Not good at all. A TA yeah. loses to Razor. Like really bad. Like later on in the game. Maybe not with a Lich. <laughs> yeah, maybe they'll do. Maybe they'll change think, lanes up. Yeah, now. maybe they'll do dual lane Lich TA. Okay. That's gonna be hard for this Night Stalker then. It, yeah. yeah. What are OG's gonna get for uh. Um, no tail, no right? They got what? Do they put Doom on no tail ever? No. Yes. No, not really. I mean, I think no. They have before. Not really they have much. before. I want to yeah. say yeah. There might have been a time or two. So they what? They do Panda, Beastmaster. What's another no tail hero that Meepo. I'm not thinking of right now? Meepo. Yeah. Meepo's oh yeah, Meepo's always there too. Ember Spirit has Spend been ignored. Nah, no, I don't think they will put him on Ember Spirit. I don't think so. Dude, if they have, if they pick Spend, they have like no damage. <laughs> they can't do any damage. <laughs> I mean, they could. It's really good versus the flat and the TA. Casual tiny. Ooh. Oh, they have, they have a lot of like big heroes though, like Lich, Dazzle. Oh, a second. Beastmaster. Okay, they're just staying with some comfort, just with their. They're gonna push good really at. hard. Yeah, that's a really good group up hero as well. Typical OG draft. <laughs> Dude, man, these team fights awful. Yeah, they have like almost no team fight aside from Gyro. They're all in on these dislaining fish. Chain like cross and call down. That's about it. Yeah, that's. I mean, they have no place, no way to keep them in place though with Chain Frost, and there's going to be bouncing between the zombies too, as well as Beastmaster. Yeah, I, I think like what you guys mentioned, if they don't win the lanes, yeah, they're they are pretty much screwed. No stuns, no lockdown for them either. Mm -mm -mm. Actually, no stuns. Homing, got homing, homing missile, missile. Bro. <laughs> and void to stop TPs, and then chain frost again. That, <laughs> that <laughs> fraction of <laughs> <mini> <laughs> fraction mini stun, <laughs> poison touch, maxed poison touch, MKB TA, KB. All right, <laughs> okay, we're really right. scratching. Well, 
Well, it's looking like uh, OG got the draft they could always hope for here. If they're a team that has like, what, two, three powerhouse drafts, this has got to be in those cards. And pressure's got to be Mineski to be able to perform here. First game of the Summit. First game of the Summit. Let's go. Let's go. I can't wait to christen it off with the first blood. First game. How many mangoes? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six mangoes. Oh, times oh. are changing. Mangoes are getting cheap. So thick in the bet in this game. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of mangoes. <laughs> no one would have gotten the numbers right. Six mangoes. Well, we got to see how they're going to be laning this. We were questioning if they were going to be throwing the Lich mid to help I think out. Ideally, the, the, the lane's pretty tough versus Razor. They've already blocked Doom spawn, so it's not that big of a deal. Oh, they saw that ward coming out, though, from yeah. OG. Ha <laughs> free nice. city gold. Nice TP from the Dazzle. Get the ward out early. <laughs> ping, Look ping, at ping, this ping, GPM ping. get ready to go up. Are they going to give it to Gyro? What do you think about the TPs? Do you think you should do it every game? On a support? Every game? I don't know about every game. Sometimes you can just mind Depends on what you're against. If they don't have strong lanes, then you don't really care. Like, you, you're probably but assuming that they're going to do, like, what? Undying Doom, try to make sure the Doom gets levels. Mm -hmm. So you want to, like, be aware, be able to have your pull open, be able to... If you want to commit three heroes up there, even though it probably will be Lich mid or Knights or with the Night Stalker bottom. All right, little bit of a tussle here. And uh, oh, the boar experience. Oh, got it. Ah. Oh, bam. Rich. And uh, that's going to be a rune split a piece here. So yeah, TA started with boots, I believe, right? I think you need to. You need to start with boots. Yeah, what's this and he got the ward gold and the bounty gold. Yeah. So he got a little and bit It seems like he's all alone, so this lane is tough for him. Yep. Oh, Which wow. is just gonna be... No. Lich, actually, is Lich moving back to middle? I, that's really good that they deward that, though, so early. Oh, Doom has access to a creep. Yeah, that's a really good point. Okay, well, TA... <laughs> okay, so the Lich is indeed moving back to middle. Oh, and Lich leading a, you know, casual yeah. rocket Spy. barrage. Yes, Scotter. Is Dazzle dead? No. Dazzle... Oh! Fine. Mmm! Hot and heavy already! Take those. Good exchange. But they, ha they have to like be able to do really well in the lanes in the next few minutes. Otherwise, when everyone gets their levels on OG, they group out and they push, it's gonna be really tough for them. Yeah. It's already starting off pretty poorly for them. Like, Night Stalker vs. BM is already BM favored. The top lane, they already got rid of a lot of Maneski's regen, and they... And block the spawn and the mid TA is yeah. not having a great time. It's, it's not looking good for yeah. them. But would you actually get the mech on Razor? I, I notice when they actually run Razor a lot, they don't actually they get, don't get the mech. Yeah. Yeah, they don't oh, get the mech. Or is it even necessary? Do you think maybe they have enough sustained power for the strat, strat you want? Yeah, for the strat you want to. So so usually Moon goes the Vlad's rush though. So I don't know if maybe yeah. he'll switch it up this game. So who's getting it? But it's really interesting what OG does with their supports. Instead of just like, you know, pulling, they know their pull's open, they just, look, flies just sitting mid, basically dual laning. And yeah, then crit is top. Basically, they can change it up. They are able to go by the early game unscathed and everyone gets their levels. That's all what they need to do yep. to be able to group up. Was Doomy what to eat? Eat a creep? Um, not sure. Not sure. <laughs> Definitely, yeah. yeah, he got a troll creep. Not the most useful creep here. It's so good XP for them though, he's almost yeah. level 3, 2 minutes in, which is yeah. really good as do off. Sure, but so far if you look at the CS, it's pretty even on all across the board, that is really really good for OG. Yeah. Uh, Razor has 70 nice, oh my god. TA's not doing too bad though, he has 7 CS, or uh, one of them's a ward actually, so he has 6 CS. I mean, he has a Lich in his lane. Yeah, he has yeah, a Lich though, if you're even with the, against the Lich, you're pretty much A-OK. -okay. Yeah. Oh, walking the the TA dog here a bit. Static link is uh quite a nasty I'm sound. Of there. A bit loud in my freaking ear here. You want to go ahead and relax a bit? The game is blowing my mind right now with how the audio is so loud. But here they're making yeah, a move. Oh, maybe it's very low. Move right could be our first blood, and it will be. It's gonna be Drews who picks it up. Mineski will Chris it off the summit floor with the first blood of the tournament. Oh my oh. god, that is so loud. That was close. Production! Can't hear, they turned it up. Can you tell them to bump it down a bit? They turned it from 10 to 11. 10 to 11. Up, up or down? Down, down, down like 30%. Little down. My goodness. Now we got Rio getting gone on. Four. Four. Four and zombies. I'll bump by them. Oh, uh oh, oh. That's a lot of slow. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Orb of Venom, two boars, some zombies. So when you need a TP scroll. Yep. He's doing well though. Nightstalker's got 11 CS. He's doing pretty decent in the offlane. 
Uh, the Lich did yeah, actually, start off he there. started there, he right. took one crit away from his okay. like one crit. Did he, was he stacking Ancients too, or is he just like yeah, dying mid? He basically took one creep and he ran over to stack Ancients okay. and so got away to mid lane. Every time Mineski goes even in lane, oh, it's just because of Lich. <laughs> <laughs> the Lich was there. Yeah, that, <laughs> that's basically what does, yeah. <laughs> Sounds seem to be improved. I can hear things. I could have it go a bit lower, to be honest with you. Yeah, right. me too. I would, like uh, I would like you lower. I would like you lower. Get back there, you got all those fancy knobs and levers, and you start tweaking around a bit. All right, let's see what happens. Nighttime and an invis. Yeah, but who's he supposed to go on? They have defensive supports in their lanes that are vulnerable. Doom has scorched earth, so maybe looking. Maybe they should rotate someone bottom and go for the Beastmaster or something. Or maybe he goes top. <laughs> I don't know. Dude, he just full tanked rocket brush. He's like, how dare you? He just, he, he, he he just he's full. Two full rocket barrages, uh, but he has this Seer creep, creep as well, yeah. so that's really nice. Can you, you know, you know I think even if the nice soccer rotates to our lanes, it's still not possible for them to get a kill. Yeah, he'll yeah. probably just chill. Uh oh, yeah, there's, there's no little team he's gotta go him, yep. for him to gain. And this is really, really bad for them. Yeah. Like, it's just 2 to 1, but for the overall strategy, it, it's looking really bad for me, Nessie. Yeah, yeah, OG has like super well fortified lanes. Look lines, at the so. Doom. Doom's 23 and 8, Gyro's only 14 and 2. So Doom's winning that really hard right now. That little help from that Winter Wyvern, and then eating that side creep. Or having that side creep open like you mentioned, because they de-warded Yeah, having the standard creep is just ridiculous. Like, even with Poison Touch and Rocket Barrage, it's incredibly difficult to break. Yeah, he just has there. too much sustain for that lane. Yeah. They don't have enough damage to actually kill him. We don't think they have enough damage, like, period. He's got his six now. Yeah. One more creep. Just no respect right now. Mineski needed to be ahead in this laning phase. You can't yeah. afford to go even, let alone be behind. They would I, need to I would even, go a bit. I would even say if they're even, it's still really bad for them. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Even, they needed to be ahead. Even if it's a 50-50 early game, it's still going to be really bad for Mineski. Oh, of course. And so they have a lot of stacks now. open to them. They realize there's no anxious. He blocked it with the hawk. <laughs> yeah, but they have the they have the large camp, and they have better roach. Actually, they don't have better roach. At least they both have roach. Yeah, I, I think it's go a lot of it is gonna be on the gyrocopter shoulder. The first rotation with the call round has to do a lot. Crit's putting a ward behind the tower, and Doom's coming out. And that's the first Doom of the game! Jarkov's trying to run! Got a nice soccer rotation. Uh-oh. Moon? They might have to trade each other here. Oh, the Zoom Blast! <laughs> he didn't get Got the brave off because of it. Ooh. Have to pull out the Man. grave to save Ooh, him. That was... That was a good heal. That was a good and big heal bomb, but 2-1. to one. Still really, really big victory for OG. Really good rotations by OG. And Jaro is forced to go on the defensive. It's yeah, it's a bad pace. Like, Jaro is even the, even the most important hero like, yeah. for them right now. And Jesse Rush is going to go down that easy, easy kill for no tail of the wall. Because Jaro Copter is the one that is going to be doing a lot of uh, pace. Yeah. He take a lot of pace. You don't want him to be six. TPing back to the lane. Because this one dying is rich. Yeah. Look at this. <laughs> That's good. How's he so rich? He he's, he's where he's had to be every single time on the rotations. Yeah, I guess at this point you can put, you can actually put the mech on Undying and Razor just goes for his carry items. Yeah. Probably. Is he doing that? Well, he's got a, a Sobi mask, at least for now. Yeah, he's gonna go for the Akilla, the usual... usual stuff. So basically for Mineski, they're gonna look to try and maybe get a hit by doing a lot of Ancient stacks or get Roshan with TA. Uh, but they have the Hawk to scout out. Yeah, yep. they're neutral. I mean, it's gonna be tough though, but those are the few things that they can look to, you know, try yeah. and accomplish. TA is farming her stacks right now. Lich is taking mid. And they're gonna be losing night time here in 10 seconds. Yeah, but in this sort of game, like, the first night time is really meaningless. Like, it's so hard for Night Soccer. Call down, comes in. Vi is like, gonna go down here. The reach undying. Yep. Radiant he didn't buy out, it looked like, either, so... He goes down with that pile of gold. Do you, do you see what he's actually going for? Didn't no, he didn't spend any gold at it all. It look like it. Okay. I think he was saving for Arcanes and he was just oh, nice. short of it. Manessi's yeah. doing a really good job of protecting their top side of the map though. After yeah. the gyrocopter died, they kind of bounced back from that. OG put two aggressive wards down. They have one watching that big camp and then they have one, I believe. Yeah, yeah. one just got dewarded though. Yep. Yeah. 
This is actually going much better than I expected for the likes. Oh, Seven Doom? Oh. Second Doom up I game. just wanted to do the Ancient Camp! Ah, oh, he seems like he's fine. He, like, Dazzle's coming okay. in. Yep, yep, he's good. Moon, though, is persistent. <laughs> Get a 180 the hell out of here. Undying's rotating. Oh, he needs you know, The whole team is going to be there. Yep. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, that shot. was no, big. Probably not right. Okay, he's going to be stepping out. They have to Delta split. <laughs> Let's just say, kill me. Yeah, take me. Take me, not my friends. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, uh, they're, they're going down for sure. Rior is going to be dropping here. TA. HP. Refraction. Not going to be enough. Call down. And this is just Mineski oh, no. crumbling down one by one. Oh, no. Dyer's bottom oh. J -O. Oh, what a heartbreaker. Thumbs up to that. <laughs> well, it didn't look like it was going to work out with that Doom. Ended up just being perfect. They all just rotated. I mean, they're forced to team fight at the point in the game where they don't really want to team fight. If the Jaro were there maybe a little bit earlier, they can just pop the Doom and then kind of retreat back to their T2. But as as the game stands right now, OG are just kind of forcing Mineski to react even with the uh, insufficient vision given by the Night Stalker. Oh, Fly does bait in Night Stalker, but if obviously at night time with the yeah. darkness, he's gonna Oh, she doesn't have a mech though, which is really good for Mineski. They can keep, I think, winning these like small skirmishes, right? At least trading pretty well up until that point. And they definitely need to keep stacking while they can. That book is gonna hurt you a have, lot. You have to get Frost off for the styling, I think. Like, someone has to build Frost off. At some point, yeah, but first you're worried about getting... I mean, who's gonna who's gonna get it? Night Stalker? Night Stalker wants uh, tags. Dazzle's not gonna have any items. Gyro's not gonna build I guess the Lich? Lich? Yeah, Lich is probably the best one. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Long but ways away. He might want a mech, though, to... But do they want a mech? Like, it doesn't seem like they'll be able to... It doesn't a... seem like it, but OG's gonna take control of the map if they don't, right? It's like, they'll lose team fights if they have a four staff, but they'll also lose team fights if they... Yeah, I guess mech. that's true. Right. But if you build a mech on the Lich, then I guess the Dazzle will be the one to build the force, or... But they probably want a medallion on him to go yeah, for Rush. Yeah, that, that too. They're, they need too many items right now, and none of them have any gold. <laughs> oh, Rior. No. Gotcha! Move in, they yell at his face. TP, he might be okay. He's gone. Yep. Nice TP. Very, very good TP. I mean, that's the weakness of the build where you go for more points in the aura and just I mean, one point in the axe. still not scared yep. though. I mean, they're they just so curse. much stronger right now with the Tomb, like, they yeah. just drop Tomb and they run in. Tomb is still on cooldown right now, but Tower is dead. Curse is up. Oh! That chain not gonna be working out too well, and it looks like we are having a little bit of a lag. No bueno. And it looked like the Courier also went down. Yep. Yeah, and Gyro's Treads. Don't. Tombs always like up in their face. They already blew call down. Tombstone should be coming nah, up. Nah, there's no there's no tombstone for this fight. It's 30 seconds. Cool yeah, I know. Yeah. Oh, 30 seconds. Oh, it's God. got such a long cooldown. Thanks for having. Oh, not happening. Nice I got a set tree. Winter's curse even gonna be pulling her out. And not even a refraction is gonna be saving little TA. Oh, oh my gonna... goodness. Seder ball almost got him. Yep. But Yikes. so far it's looking. Still looking really grim for Mineski. They just lost the tower and losing even more map control. The Ancients is going to be really hard for them to access right now with the tier one and mid lane down. Oh, I mean, Doom just keeps running in their face and they can't they can't deal with them. He's able to like access the back line. He can just straight walk past the front line, Doom the Dazzle, and yeah, everyone has this to run is the away. problem when you have Dazzle and Lich and you don't have a off lane that has a lockdown. Like, yeah. you don't have a, a hard lockdown, so Doom is able to just run around in the fights and you're not gonna be... It's the same when you're up against Slada. He runs around with sprint and you don't have a stun, and you can't do anything against him. As you can see, everyone coming and filing in throughout the day. Most people not even here yet. Only the two teams, pretty much. And Liquid, I guess, showed up. Where they we saw EG. Practice, EG's here, but... too. Oh, EG is here? Yep. Oh, I didn't see him, but... Ehome was here, too. Yeah, all right, well, apparently I didn't see anyone. I was focused on work. <laughs> What's wrong with all you guys' work. vision? Jeez. Me? <laughs> what hero is that? You're leaning well, on Well, at least I, I see, I see the humans running around the house. Getting slouchy over here? 
I can't watch it like this. <laughs> it's hurting, it is hurting my back a bit. I know. <laughs> oh, like, I can't watch it like this. Bro, is that is that the way? <laughs> I don't think that's the way. All right. Yes, that's the way. It's still the way. Oh, oh. Oh, this is the way. Oh. This isn't very comfortable. <laughs> that that looks a little too feminine. <laughs> okay, how about this? <sighs> I mean, I guess I approve. Your feet all over the couch. You're cute. As long as Yannis doesn't mind. Didn't you see like some of the players actually play like this? Yeah. Not, I'm not surprised everybody. lots of players play like that, or the one knee up kind of a thing, or the two, or the, the air cross with the hands under what? on the keyboard. What? I mean, you have... I don't think that one. <laughs> that was a joke, gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> the, air, the air cross. <laughs> What's your gamer position? When you play. You're a leg up kind of a guy, aren't you? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. He is. Do you tap? Oh, dude! You, you, I saw Bamboo play. He he played on the couch with his keyboard in his lap and his mouse like this. Was he played his like, like up? He as played well. like this. His keyboard was right here where my arm is. Really? Yeah. Interesting. And so he that's, sat on the couch and the monitor was right here. Is that the funniest one you've seen? That's Definitely. how he actually. No, Jai. Yeah, I mean, he, he was just relaxing and like playing yeah, clubs. But you oh, see Jai? Yeah, yeah Jai. That guy. Him play. He's like that. He puts his keyboard like this and his mouse like that. Like that far giant, apart. Yeah, like you could put a plate in the middle to eat while you're playing. Oh, oh fair. Right. Game looks like, like uh, with no hands. They flipped some knobs, unplugged, replugged. They blew on the cable. I don't know what they had to do, but we got a game back underway here. And what was it? It was OG pushing down mid. Took that OTL CA. picked up his Necro book. He's got it in his stash. He almost has level two of the good book. That's a zookeeper, right? So there. now, like glitch, pretty much is like very, very useless. There's like not that much physical damage that he's blocking with his armor. They lost the laning phase, even with Dark Rit, and his Chain Frost is gonna have to deal with like Necro books and zombies and like all all these things. So and no lockdown. This, so this gonna... is or like okay, maybe if they had an AA, they can actually have a chance of winning these team fights and dealing with the Doom, maybe bursting down the Doom. But all he's really done is like stack for them in the early game. But there's no economic advantage that Manessa yeah, has gained at all. We are, we are really stretching it really far, like trying to figure out something that they can actually do. Yeah. But but I think overall when you're running a draft that has no stuns, it's either you're able to burst down a target really quick, mm -hmm. so it it actually helps that you don't have stuns. Oh, right have now, so much damage that it doesn't matter. Yeah. Right now Mineski, they, they can't even kill like one hero. It's so hard for them to burst one, one hero down. Even if they land all their combos correctly, it's still really hard. At least Dazzle's a medallion. I guess. Are they going to be able to do a rush? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe that's that's the just, they'd have to hope uh -oh. for a team white, which OG are already pulling out something freaking fishy here. They are smoked up and on the move. And I, I think they just picked up the book two, and I think Moon just oh, picked up his drum. <gasps> yeah, they battle. have a hawk there. Oh. Oh. They, they saw they the saw ball. Oh. Did they see it? Didn't they? I think Maybe so. Not. And I think Night Soccer lost his smoke, oh, so he knew something's up. Now. Uh oh, oh, the jig is up. The jig might be up here. Hey, he's just uh -oh. gonna zoom one guy and they're gonna roll the other guy and the team fights over. Oh, oh they split up and, just dead. and these two went the wrong way. Oh, definitely Jesse Bash. <laughs> Poor Lich. <laughs> he's gonna lob off a of frost, say his prayers, and he's going down. Nice soccer got away at least. I thought the Beastmaster would catch him with the roar, but his hawk. I think ended up dying beforehand. I think the Razor is actually very good versus Nice Tucker. Not only does he have like uh, like unstable current, you don't want to go on him, but he just used Plasma Field, and they saw two heroes immediately through yep. darkness. Right? That's, that's pretty good. Yeah, they have a lot of vision from the Plasma plus the Hawk plus Tombstone. Yeah. Or plus zombies. Yeah, I think it's actually sur surprising amounts of vision. They just Man, like we said though, OG's just gonna you know get get their levels and then just group up. And now they they're go. gonna they're gonna threaten high ground with book too. Can they even defend this? They don't have Chain Frost. I don't see uh, them being able to do anything uh, there. Be. Nice Talker's not summons. there. T is not think there. So they didn't even use Book for that last fight. Or oh Tombstone. Oh my god. Rex down 15 minutes. What R do they have on Doom? Um, I think the Ursa. Like my tax oh yeah. my the gosh. Alright, this is it. Call down. And they're just going to walk off the welcome mat and wait a bit. Okay. Oh, well, that's a free T3. They could take Roche at any point. Yep. They got all their ults up. Three. Yeah. <laughs> they can do whatever they want. They can just wait for the lanes to be pushed out, group up, wait for someone to go back to base to region, and just take their own sweet time. It's yeah. very hard for Mineski to contest whatever they're trying to do. They can smoke right now. What little bit of nighttime they have left. 
Yeah, they have to try that. Six, 60 try. minutes yeah. is the they end of the night time. Yeah, they have to try to roast or something, but they're gonna get caught and they see the smoke. Oh, anyway. yeah, that's... <sighs> not good. This, but this is... Realistically, the only chance they have, though. They have, they have to be able to take Roche or get a pick and then take Roche, and then they can maybe fight during the day. They're gonna see, they see this right away, the oh, Hawks are already there. Okay. They could manipulate this in their favor, wait till it's almost done, take it over, take the fight, and probably take a set of racks. If the dream is alive. They yeah, do have Winter's Curse a fight here and then lose the fight, the game is probably gonna just be over for yep. I mean, I see They have to be yeah. able to. I mean, it's gonna be low. They have to fly over the curse here in a second. Oh, no, oh, J.O.C. Man looks behind. <laughs> He's down. That was a uh, decent call down. Oh, fall. Chain Frost bounced to neutrals. That is... Oh, no. So unfortunate TA's for gone. Q Doesn't great, have a but... TP. No oh. chance. Oh, wow. The, the hateful <laughs> doom right there. <laughs> right in the face. <laughs> He's just like, I have to use this. You gotta go. Boom. <laughs> this should be an oh, easy look, rose for OG. Nice, nice and low for us, guys. <laughs> <laughs> and that probably looks like... So at this point, Mineski need OG to just kind of go, let's play with our feet now. Yeah. <laughs> the air cross pose. <laughs> you remember the, some of those the leg cross pose that Dakota was talking about before? The legs yeah. cross pose. The legs cross pose. <laughs> they basically have everything they need to f just finish the game right now. Yeah, full and map control. I think for Mineski to win, it's like call down on 5 and then hopefully a chain force bounces on every single hero. And OG just don't use spells. <laughs> they focus the, the grave target for five seconds. <laughs> everything just went, you know, like we were saying, OG just, everything went well for them. The rotations were on point. Gyro got pressured extremely hard by the Doom, and then the rotation from the Wyvern and Undying was just, you yeah, know, perfect. Would you guys say OG are favorites for this tournament? All together? I don't think they, so. They probably have a bit of a target on their back. Not, maybe not favorites favorites, but... People are still going to be looking the at them. The stronger teams are around. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they they kind of been like building a bit of the way that people have been drafting, the way OG does. Yeah. People have changed up just because of that. Oh, J.O. Portson gets roared. He's out. He does dead. he have buyback? No, he does not. 40 seconds, he's going to be on those sidelines. He, he has buyback. He does? Yeah, uh, he See, does. that's where I can't see anything, winner. You can see that, but you can't see Slardar's band. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Come on, man. Ruthless. <laughs> well, I'm requesting... A seat change. I don't want to be next to next to the Kotal guy anymore. Do you want to get leaned on by Ben? <laughs> it's not too bad. <laughs> He's so relaxed over here. here. <laughs> oh, they're moving in. Rax is already exposed. OG looking to take the game. They can't fight. And Miniski are just like, I don't know. We can't do anything about it. They may have had a buyback, but they're opting not to spend so it. So many auras. That timer was so low. They got blast. I think they were really missing a strong... A... Like aggressive lane support, like the Bane, I think, instead of the Lich would have been really, really nice for them. Just because, like, OG had like one support sitting in each of the weak lanes, and then a Doom with Scorched Earth and Seder Aura in one of the other lanes. Yep. Yeah. Well, Mineski revolved around getting kills in the early game and take building off that momentum, but they never even had a momen momentum at the start, even with the Lich. I, but, I think the other thing they could have done was definitely the Stalker, the Stalker not the call, and you pick someone that has a stun to help the other lanes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that could have helped. What's <laughs> up? <laughs> yeah. This is amazing. <laughs> Looks like yeah. They're they're just trapped. They don't even know where to go. They're trying to push out lanes. The supports. Dazzle's like, I got this. He's mega creeps. Could already be thinking about game two. What do you do at that point? Do you start uh, thinking outside the box a bit? I mean, OG just seems one of those teams that's hard to just ban against. And now it's like, oh, well, maybe we gotta go back to first banning the Doom, and then you leave something like a Wisp out, and you're like, oh, god damn it, they're it's all so like, Wisp team. It's not even like the bans that were being yeah, bad, I don't think it was just the overall the that they were going for. I mean, what was it? Committing for a first pick Night Stalker without really seeing what you're going up against? I think the Night Stalker is fine, though. It's just after that, how they follow up with the draft was... A lot of issues. They didn't have stuns. They didn't have much AOE. That's why I suggested the Invoker, so it would allow them to have stuns yeah. and some AOE Deep push. Yeah. As well, too much priority in the lanes themselves. That when it's time for a fight, they're kind of like, we weren't. This isn't our job, really. Like their drop is so all in that if your first five minutes do not work well for you, you basically just lose the game from there. That is how how all in their drop is. Hey, they might get a nice little freebie here. Call down. 
the Void Slow. No Tail's gonna be going down here, and here comes the rest the of the team. They're pissed off about it. Jo. Jo's gonna be done. That's a two for there for Moon. Easy grab. Your carry right. just got killed by the Necrobook. Yeah, he, he basically died alone to Necrobook. Yeah, and uh, you take one of ours, we take three years. Not four. Better make it. Oh, maybe not. I just call the GG. It's probably a good idea. And it is all over! And that is gonna be game one of the summit for a stomping coming in from Team OG. Mineski will need to shake this one off. Otherwise, they're looking at a quick 0 2 to it start. It now looks like a number run. 6 versus number 7 matchup. Mineski's yeah. standings appear to have not been the most accurate thing. They might need to revamp those a little bit based on the conclusion of this series. But you never know, maybe Mineski just gonna be brought down, need the warm up, let's say, and. Might be able to fire back. It's not even about the warm-up though, I think it's just about... <laughs> the Winter's saying, nah, they have no chance. 